What is up guys? Welcome to another Battle Factory Live today. We are not alone. We are with Tony99 Rock. I forget how to say your alias. What is it again? Go for it. <laughs> T99R. T99R. Sure, sure. That we'll, we'll, we'll work with that. We are uh, going to be hitting up the uh, Battle Factory server today. Uh, glad to have somebody on board with uh, with me today. Uh, how you doing, man? Uh, I've, been, I've been doing well. Summer school's been rough. You're in summer school? Yeah. Oh, no way. That sucks, man. <laughs> yeah. Sorry to hear. All right. Well, uh, you're uh, you're logged into my account, right? Ready to yep. go? All right. Let's pick up a battle right here. We tried to do this yesterday, but Discord and Camtasia were not communicating properly, so I uh, had to had to end that swiftly. You ended up using the team today, uh, in a, well, yesterday in a live, so on my own, unfortunately. But uh, we got uh, what is this? Nu? This looks a like Nu. Uh, Pu. You sure it's Pu? Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No, you're probably right. Um, no, Mil Tank is definitely Nu, dude. So is right on. Actually, we got a, a mean team, like a really good team. Oh. He, he's got like pseudo sun with nine tails and pyro, but um, well, we should be able to counter that. Uh, what do we got? What do we got over here? We have a uh, choice specs Rotom. Very nice. That uh, we can volt switch on anything except for Pilot Swine if you want to do that. Uh, we can also trick its Eviolite Light away. Um, yeah, I think that's your best lead, actually. Probably wrote him. So wait, who's taking first battle? Me or you? You. Go for it. Alright. So, trick. Yeah. Trick it away. And uh, he should more than likely go for rocks right here. Yep. So now you can Volt Switch for free. Because he's, he's going to switch out no matter what. He's probably going to go into Tangela, to be honest. It's probably his best switch. Uh, and then we, I guess we go Garbodor and start setting up some toxic spikes since his entire. T oh well, he has a skun tank. That wouldn't be great. Um, oh, we have we have regular spikes. We don't even have toxic spikes. That's good. Okay, we're good. Did you click Volt Switch? Yeah. All right. Cool. 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 All right. So this is actually a pretty good matchup for Garbodor if you just want to go straight into it and uh, start setting up them spikes. Yes. And every time he hits us, he gets Rocky Helmet damage, so that's really good. We can drain. Oh, we're Rocky. Yeah, oh, we're Rocky, yeah we're Rocky Helmet. Unless he's special, he could be special. We got pretty good special defense, though, so I'm not worried. Set up a what? spike right here. Yeah, they're exactly the same. Yeah. There we go. Only take 38 from that. No burn. Very nice. You can go for a Drain Punch right here if you want to. He misses the Fire Blast. Oh, awesome. Nice. All right. And uh, we should be good to take two more, right? First one did... Oh, no. 38. Okay. I would Drain Punch again, honestly. And uh, heal back some of the damage. Yeah, that's good. There we go. Alright, so if Pillow Swine go comes back in, you go straight into Rotom. You save this for, like, I don't know, the Tangela or the Samurott. Go ahead. To Rotom. Yeah, you switch right out. Right out of here. Specs Pillow Swine, gotta love that. And uh, once again, you're free to Volt Switch. That's so awesome. <laughs> gotta love Specs Pillow Swine, man. It's pretty so much useful. just instant win for us. Gotta play smart, though, but... Okay, he can stay in and waste all his Earthquake PP. Just keep clicking Volt Switch. He's gonna have to switch eventually. Yeah, there we go. Nine Tails comes in. This is gonna do a good amount. 32%. And, um... What's our, what's our Prime Ape? Prime Ape Banded. Is. Okay, but we might not outspeed. Print Plup is a pretty good play. If you just want to get up rocks at this point. Uh, in this team, the rocks do so much. Yeah, honestly. Yeah, it's looking good. Looking like a good uh, first NU win right here. Which is, so. which is rare. Yeah, uh, yeah. Just go for it. He'll probably go for Sunny Day anyway. Or and or that. Is he? Yeah, he's Life Orb. Okay. Um. Personally. You can go into the mill tank where Sap Sipper. Oh. Yeah. yeah. We got up our rocks. We get the Sap Sipper boost, and now we can just body slam everything. Awesome. Why do we have two stealth rockers? Ooh, that did a lot. Damn. Not being thick fat really does not do us good. Um, Let's see. I mean, there's nothing you can really go into to like destroy us how bulky are we 336 defense oh you eat this up hit him up with the body slam man he doesn't have his evia light anymore either or you can milk drink it's up to you i'm not gonna risk anything milk drink yeah that's good you are faster yeah there we go and now you can body slam 
I think this just wins, honestly. With the uh, with the hazards up, that did nothing. Luckily, we got the para, <laughs> and he gets fully paired on that turn too. Yeah, just body slam again, and we'll be up to 82 after this turn. Looking good, man. Good job, good job, you did it, man. <laughs> you, yes, I clicked the button. <laughs> you pretty much did everything. Um, this thing is scary. I don't know if you want to risk the toxic, or. Yeah. Yeah. You still hear me, right? Yeah. Okay, because Lump. like Skype says, um, Skype says that my microphone is disconnected when it's clearly not. Okay, I cannot. I I hear cutting off, but it's better than yesterday. Oh, is it? Yeah. Okay, but I think it's my actual mic. This could be a problem. Anyway. Um, Sied Lumberry. Yeah. Okay. So, um, body slam, I guess, or just if you want to toxic again, I don't know. It's up to you. Body slam's good, yeah. Waterfall. And that did nothing for a plus two waterfall. And will an awkward kill us if he has? No, it? no way. It does half of waterfall. So you just body slam again. Yeah. Not even a crit would have taken us out. Sitting pretty. Very nice. You still hear me, right? Yeah. Okay, okay. I'm just so scared because now even Camtasia recorder is lagging, so... That's fine, though. I, I won't pause the recording at any time from now on. Because that's what makes it just die. <laughs> um, this thing is definitely going to outspeed you. And it's going to... Fire blast. Kill so. you. <laughs> so... Uh, well, but you don't really have a play, you just have to stay in and go for body slam. And then you have to play around this core of Pyro and uh, Tangela, but he can't keep switching in his Pyro because we have hazards up. So you can go right on and just throw out an Earthquake at this point. And two, where is it? I can't find it. Okay, what, there. right on? <laughs> I couldn't find it's it. It's right there! Oh no. Okay, we're good, we're good. So... Rock Polish? Uh, earthquake? Yeah, I would just Earthquake. Screw it. He's probably locked in a Hyper Voice too, so... Yeah, the Tangle is fine. Just gonna get an Earthquake off on that. That's gonna do absolutely nothing. Uh, I would just switch into Garbodor at this point. Seems like a fine play. And then just throw off a Gunk Shot if he doesn't knock you out. Sleep Powder. Or that, okay. Um, yeah, just keep, like, click Gunk Shot repeatedly. It doesn't even matter. You can go for Seeds. That's, that's uh. okay. Um, does... Uh, yeah, we have U-Turn on Primeape, so you want to go into that and probably just U-Turn. Get some damage off on this thing. It is Regenerator, but, um, like, if we can weaken it, then we're good to go. Or, nah, I want to risk Gunk Shot. No, no, don't risk Gunk Shot. Because if he gets a Sleep Powder off on you, you're pretty much gone. Yeah, that's good damage. I would go into Print Plup, personally. And, uh, when he puts you to sleep, or knocks you out, I guess... Uh, now you go for gunk shot. Now you don't have a choice. I was expecting him to sleep you, but that's okay. You turned it 28. Gunk shot should be able to take it out in theory. Uh, well, actually, no. Maybe not. Uh, anyway, it's still your best move. So, yeah, there we go. That's good damage. Goes for the powder and misses. Ouch. We have to hit this shot, though. Yeah, nice. there we go. Okay, awesome. And now Pyro comes in. Locks itself into a move, and then we go into whatever we need to in response. Uh, Hyper Voice, we can go into Rotom. Fire Blast, we can go into Ride On. So, just Gunk Shot again. There we go. Now you go into Ride On, and you knock this thing out. I swear, if he's not actually locked into anything, and he goes for Hidden Power Grass right here, <laughs> that'd be terrible. That did so much, that's definitely specs. Yep, there we go. First battle down. Alright, so yeah. we'll hop right into the next one. I'm, going, I'm grabbing this one. Okay. We might be able to get four, but I can't see what time we're at, so. Every once in a while, the time updates. Yeah, now we're at 8.42. There you go. All right. <laughs> so, let's see. What are we going to get on this ladder? Might take time to find some games, actually, because it's pretty late. So, you want to check on your end uh, how many... Actually, I can do it on mine. How many games there are in Battle Factory. Let's see. Ooh, that's not the right one. One. <laughs> Literally, oh, no, 21. Okay, yeah, I, I the same thing happened to me. It was one, and then it refreshed. <laughs> the guy we just played is playing another one already. Wow. Joe S. Lowe. Right up at the top there. What's our rating? Uh, 13 something. something. We got somebody that's in the 1100s, really? All right. What's the ladder like for Battle Factory? Uh, let's see. 
Where is Battle Factory? There it is. Randomized metas. And... Oh, wow. It only goes up to 1581. So are we... And are we top? I don't even know if we're top. Let me just check real quick. We get RU. Yes. We're almost in top, actually. We can probably make it to top by the end of the episode. Like, top 500. Uh, my <laughs> Our opponent has an extremely scary team, but... We have a Metacham, so... I'm not too concerned. Ooh. Uh... I think your best lead is probably... Blastoise. Wait, it, it's your game. Yeah, you're right. I think my best lead is probably Blastoise. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go with that. Uh, yep, called it right. <laughs> I was not expecting this at all. I was expecting the uh, the Acelgor, and I just wanted to be able to spin on it. But uh, this works too. I'm gonna burn off fresh. on something. Yeah. I've never seen refresh. Yeah, it's it's really good for getting rid of poison and stuff. Increase your longevity. This thing is so good with leftovers; it's not even funny. So bulky. Look at that: 361 HP, 322 def uh, 328 defense, 246 spadef. That's uninvested. Goes into Polyrath, which has water absorb. That's fine. We can toxic this thing. Wear it down. Goes for circle throw, misses, unfortunately. Uh, now we can go into. I thought we had a ghost for a second, but we don't. Um, I think we just stay in and rapid spin <laughs> on this thing. Yes. That's like our only play, legitimately. Refresh. Yeah. And if he switches out him into like Rhyperior on this turn, I'm gonna predict him to go back into Polyrath and just rapid spin again. <laughs> Uh, Let's see. Polyrath is really good, man. It's so good. Fighting in water is so good. I'm so psyched for uh, Pop Leo's final evolution if it actually turns out to be water and fighting. I'm, I'm not aware of anything about Sun and Moon. Not even the starter names? Uh, I know there's a uh, Litten, I think. Yeah, Litten, Rowlet, and Pop Leo. Uh, yeah. So the three. There you go. I just spoiled it for you. You happy? <laughs> you did, the, you did name, name this. Name doesn't bother me, just gameplay wise. Oh, okay. You did this to yourself, by the way. <laughs> uh, let's hyper voice here. Sigalif comes in. We have Shadow Ball for this thing. Wait, aren't these. Okay, then we're scarred. No, we're not. We're not. We're not. Um, what does it... more, hyper voice or Shadow Ball? Hold on, let me think of this. 135, 160. Yeah, Shadow Ball should be able to knock this thing out. If he doesn't, if he's not faster than us in roosts. Uh, but now we got the Spadef drop, so we can even go for a hyper voice right here and predict him to, like, I don't know. Going to Blastoise or something. He shouldn't want to stay in right here. And burning us would do nothing. Exactly. So. We're looking pretty good with Meloetta. Plus we're Calm Mind. Like we could just win with this. Goes for the Air Slash. Try to get the flinch. She gets it. Amazing. Gotta love oh that. I'm just gonna Thank keep you. spamming Hyper Voice. He's just gonna keep spamming Air Slash and let his Sigalith go down. Which was like the biggest threat to our entire team. Uh, now that thing's gone, a Selgor comes in. It does have a super effective move on us. Um, but I have, like, a straight counter to this. Yup. Wow. <laughs> that did nothing. And now we get up rocks. And this is Life Orb of Selgor, too. That, Wait, what? That was Life Orb damage. Okay. Yeah. No, the Yancey's ridiculously bulky, dude. Like, it's Mega Evolution. It's, it's, it's crap. It's garbage. <laughs> but uh, in terms of defense. But it's... Uh, it's Pre Mega Evo is so bulky. It's stupid. Especially for this tier. Now, once again, I don't have a ghost, so I can't prevent the spin. I'm just gonna go for Moon Blast. And uh, weaken this thing a little bit. Try to lower its special attack. We do not, unfortunately. I'm gonna keep spamming Moon Blast, though. Scald is going to do nothing. Look at that. You know how much that would have done to Deancey and OU? Like Mega? Would have done like 60. <laughs> Easy. And Moon Isn't Blast again. Does it defenses drop? Uh, what do you mean? Yeah, no, no, no. It's it's not that it, its defenses drop. It's that you don't invest in them, and its HP is uh, crap. Actually, no, no, no. Its its defenses do drop. Excuse me. Yeah, it goes all into speed and special attack and attack. That's what gets boosted. So he's in torrent right now, which means he can do a lot more damage this turn. Um, so I think I just moon blast here. Again, that's fine. Yep. Crit. That's fine. Okay, cool. We're able to take out the Blastoise. And the Selgor shouldn't be an issue because we do have a Sneasel. So we can Ice Shard it later. 
I'm just worried about the polyrath at this point, which he goes into. Is he faster than us? Yeah, he definitely is. 100% of the time. I think he just goes for a water move here, right? Um, like, why do I have a bunch of frail Pokemon? It's crazy. I'm going into Drapion. Screw it. <clears throat> See, he goes for Scald. No burn. No burn. Awesome. I'm going to uh, be able to Poison Jab right here. Get this thing lowered. Very nice. Scald comes through. Burns me, unfortunately. But I am just going to Poison Jab again. And nothing wants to take this. Not even Rhyperior, because I can knock it off after. Which is good. And Blastoise is still sitting at 80, 86%. So having this Polyrath weakened is extremely important. Um, he's just going to go for rest. Oh, that's not good. Hold on a second. We're at how much? 12.8. So we can live burn. Do I just... Knock off. Blastovers. Actually... Uh, yeah, no, that's a good play, for sure. Yeah, get rid of the uh, the lefties on this thing. Man, rest is so annoying. Rest, Polyrath, Circle Throw, Scald, Rest, and what? Sleep Talk? That makes sense. <clears throat> I think that's its usual set. We shall see, though. Get rid of the, knock the uh, leftovers right there, which is nice. Please land an attacking move. Oh, he didn't even go for Sleep Talk. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna throw off a Poison Jab for damage. And uh, he is not going to sleep talk again. Interesting. All right. Well, um, I think it's time. Uh, it is time. Something is dying, like, straight up. Yeah, I'm just going to go for Zen. Oh, man. This thing lived? Really? That's crazy. Scald. He gets another burn. Damn. We'll still kill it. Yeah, but he's going to switch. He's not staying in with it. What? Who, sw who stays in? Now Blastoise wins. And I lo I actually like that I'm burned because Vivillion can never put me to sleep. Selgor comes in. I'm going to sack the Ansi here. I don't even know if this is going to be a sack. It is. Okay. <laughs> um, now we go for rock. Yeah, exactly. But he okay. still knocks us out. That's fine. Um, let's see. Sneasel gets Oko'd, I think, from a Life Orb of Selgor. Yeah, I can just throw off a Scald at this point. That's fine. I'm just gonna do that. Uh, does this thing get Energy Ball? No, I'm kind of scared. Energy Ball, let me check. I'm really worried. Okay, I just went for Bug Buzz anyway. That's fine. Yeah, yeah it gets Energy Ball. Okay, well, he didn't go for it, so we're fine. Um, that did 46, though. So, yeah, now I'm terrified. Um... I think my play is to sack Medicham. And then go for the Ice Shard? Yeah, exactly. Or wear him down himself. Well, that was the initial point, yeah, but... Like, I just want something that's faster than Vivillion in. That's all. Like, I don't really care about Rhyperior coming in because I can just go right back out into Blastoise on this thing. As he goes for Rock Blast, it's gonna do nothing. Um, well, I mean, it's gonna, it's gonna do a good amount there, but he should be slower than us. Yeah, he's always slower than us unless he's max speed. So I'm just gonna go for the Scald right here. He lets his Vivillion Sash get broken, which is amazing. Uh, it's not Sash, it's for some reason... Life. Well, leftovers, left. yeah. Um, I think I'm just going to switch into Meloetto here. He goes for the Sleep Powder, exactly. Um, can you calc Sneasel's Life Orb Ice Shard on Vivillion? Yep. Because I just don't want this thing getting up too many, uh, uh, too much leftovers recovery to where it's out of range. If it does, like, 70, I'm just gonna stay in with this thing. Uh, are you Quiver Dance Sweeper yeah. and Sneasel? I sure does 80 to 94. Awesome. Okay. So I can just stay in. That's fine. And just spam, I guess, Calm Mind. Like he's going to have to attack me eventually, right? I don't know. I think we could still lose this, but he has to, like, play immaculately. Like, he has to never attack Meloetta. And, like, the turn that I decide to switch on in the Sneasel, he has to attack. So, he's gonna go for sub. Ooh, that's not good. Um, 
Actually, hold on. How fast are we? Okay, we're not faster than him. I'm gonna go for my own sub here. He's gonna go for Hurricane. That's gonna not knock us out at all. Why did I not wake up? Oh, I got max sleep. Okay. Um. Now I think I have to... Hyper Can voice. you calc Meloetta's hyper voice? This is like modest, I think. 321 spe Make sure it's 321 special uh, attack. Substitute call mine? Yeah. Uh, make sure it has 321 special attack. 320... No, not not the EVs, but like its actual attack hits yeah. hits uh, 321. And calc hyper voice to a plus one special defense of Ilion. Plus one. Well, e even without the. Okay, wait. What well, my bad? Plus one. Wait, what? What? That's that. That's side shock. Whoops. Hyper. Yeah, hyper. Uh, seventy-five point seven to eighty-nine. At plus one special defense. Yeah. Really? We're not life orb, eh? We're leftovers. Yeah. What the heck? Okay, this thing is frail. As long as he doesn't crit us here, we're good. We wake up, and we should knock this out with the hyper voice. Yep, there we go. Perfect. Don't you just love how sound moves hit behind subs? <laughs> That's what I was worried about, actually. Like, I would have rather bro broken his sub, but I couldn't with Shadow Ball. So I it needed to be hyper voice right there. Um, Rock polish could be a scary, scary thing right now. I'm just gonna Shadow Ball for the most amount of damage. 21, that did nothing. Okay, good, he attacked us. We're good. Blastoise comes in, fires off a Skull, then even if it doesn't kill for whatever reason, because of- nice Yeah, we have Ice Shard in the back, so. Or Icicle Wait. Crash. Yeah. So we should be good. And, uh, what do you want to do for the last one? You want to, like, do one turn me, one turn you? Mm. Like, I'll leave the- I'll leave the- Whoa. I'll leave the play completely up to you. I won't even talk, like. I don't think I enjoy that. No, come on, you're pretty good. You know what you're doing. Yeah, but... There we go, oh. and the Rhyperior is down. Awesome, okay. No, let's do it, come on. I believe in you, man. Tony, you got this. Okay. All right, so let's see if we can actually get a battle. I can't even pause it right now just because of my... My Camtasia recorder is like all messed up and it's just stopped, so... Um. It should be good though, that it should still be recording because the time is like skipping gradually from time to time. Hopefully it doesn't like mess up your audio and desync it with mine because that's happened before. And that was really unenjoyable to try to edit. So. Yeah. Uh, is, is there now one person on playing Battle Factory? Like, okay. oh. All right. As soon as I say that, we always find a game. Okay, and we got my favorite tier. All right, so uh, um, we have two quad rock weeks. It's very annoying, um, and we have no hazard removal. Natural gift lychee berry. What is that? On who? Talonflame. What's lychee berry? What kind of natural gift is it? Sorry for the typing. Yeah, it's fine. Please tell me it's like electric. <laughs> that would be uh, so good here. Lychee is grass. That's not bad. Grass. We, we, can still, we can still hit the slow, bro. That's pretty good. Uh, 80 power. Oh no, uh, 100 power. 100 power? Yeah. Dude! Yo, you want to lead with it? Shh. Sure. And just like uh, swords dance and then like knock out the hippo? <laughs> Be insane. Let's go. Let's do it. Yeah, it is natural. It's natural gift grass. Yeah. All right. Let's see. Oh, oh come on. <laughs> He's not dealing with it. All right. Taunt him. Uh, taunt him. Taunt him. Taunt him. Taunt. Taunt. Right now. Keep him from getting up rocks. This is only rock setter. There we go. Get up your own rocks. Mess with his head. <laughs> I wonder. Are there any fairy berries? I don't think so. Oh my god, we're Choice Scarf Landorus with Explosion. Wait. Whoa. That's amazing. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, just get a Brox, I think. Oh wait, weren't we doing one turn, one turn? That's what we were doing, right? Okay, I'm taking over from here. This is my turn. And he went into Togekiss. Very interesting. 
fairy move. I don't care. I'm knocking yeah. out his Togekiss. <laughs> like, really? <laughs> Why do you go to your you flying don't. type on a rock type? Okay, we have, like, the direct counter to this. You want to click it? Wait, what? We, ha I'm we have, like, the best counter in the game to this. On our team. Talon. Talon flame? Obviously. Okay. <laughs> I was scared. Come on. It's going for a grass move. You quad resist that. Uh, it's Who it's life orb. I would personally just swords dance. Swords dance and brave bird or flare blitz. Yeah, because we're choice scarf Lando anyway. We don't lose from doing that. We're gonna go for, for pulse. We're gonna live that. And um, we don't. Wait, what? Oh, oh, it's true. Damn. <laughs> I forgot that activates. <laughs> oh man, that sucks. We're gonna lose our talent flame. Go for a brave bird. Who cares? It's fine. We don't need this for anything else. Just needed it for Serp. Anything else would have died to a Brave Bird, though. <laughs> that would have been amazing. Lychee Berry ha um, activates kind of like um, a Salic Berry at 25%, and it increases your attack. When, when it's in a pinch, don't Yeah, exactly, that. which means... Uh, that when it's below a quarter. Yeah, exactly, 25% or less. Yeah. Um, sounds like a car deal or something. <laughs> All right, is this my turn? Yeah, this is uh, my turn. Go for it. All right, yeah. let's, uh, let's go into this. Seems like a solid play. Nope, not a solid play. <laughs> All right, I think V create just like straight up knocks us out. So, oh, oh, never mind. All right, so I'm I'm making this play. You grab the next one. It's a little hard to coordinate, but I think we're like at 22 minutes roughly. That's what Camtasia is telling me anyway. It's stuck at like 21:20 right now. <laughs> and guy, we're at 30 minutes. So that's about right, right? We yeah. were on call for like six, seven minutes before. Yeah. That's good. Yeah, now I'm at 25. Never mind. <laughs> it just finally skipped. There we go. All right, so um, going into this because... Oh, okay, he's special. Which means he probably doesn't have uh, Bolt Strike. So you can probably just um, Scald without Mega Evolving, I think. Oh, never mind. Fun. He has Thunder. Okay, we're gone. Um, <laughs> uh, Landorus? I think Landorus in wow. U-turn, right? Because he's probably gonna have like um, Glaciate, which is the uh, the ice one. And and then we go into Frolicator. Yeah, thundered. I don't think so. We go into Terrakion because we're faster. Oh uh, yeah. Actually, we could probably go Terrakion now, but anyway. Doesn't Shit. Matter. Um. Yeah. You you click this move. I'm leaving this up to you. You can U-turn or you can Earthquake. It's really your call. Like, Earthquake. Nice. Good call. Good call. Alright, I'll grab the next one. Um, we don't have anything on for alligator for this slow bro. That's the only thing I'm worried about. And this is... No, nah, this is probably not his mega, right? His mega can be his or... Exactly. I'm going into gator. On the skull, I'm risking the burn. That's fine. Alright, we're good. Um, what are we? Life for him? Okay, let's go for a dragon dance. Like, literally, he resists all of our moves. Oh, okay, he thunderwaved us. <clears throat> That's amazing, because now he can't burn us. I'm just going to keep DDing. And uh, if he switches out into anything, then I'm just going to click Waterfall. I think if we weaken this, then Landorus wins. Sasha. Yeah, it's fine. Whatever. So, what can we hit this thing hardest with? I think Waterfall. Waterfall and superpower hit the same. So I'm just gonna go for the waterfall. Because I don't take um, life orb damage from it. We're actually still faster, which is awesome. Which means we have, we have a chance to flinch. Wait, why don't you take life orb damage? Because sheer force prevents life orb damage if it has a secondary effect. Which, um. Oh. Yeah, which, um. Superpower, oh, superpower doesn't have a secondary uh, effect. So. Um. Oh, we're not Lum Volcarona. Damn. Um, you want to calc neutral Volcarona with uh, with 306 special attack to see if well, I think that's uninvested to see if Giga Drain knocks out a standard Slowbro set. Slowbro defensive. Oh, you defensive, yeah. Make sure it's not Mega Slowbro. Not that not, yeah, that, uh, that actually makes a difference, but. Wait, what move am I looking for? Drain. Fifty minimum. Yes. Yeah. Let's do it. 
we can set up on everything else. So wait, 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 What's wait, up? wait, 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 wait. What did you do? Okay, okay, still forty one. Okay, cool. What what did you do? Like, uh, it was a uh, I call that, eh, modest. Oh okay. Um. Okay, so this thing had whirlwind. Is he really gonna have stone edge? He would have gone for that on talon flame, right? Most probably. Yeah, let's just go for drain. Screw it. That's fine. Earthquake. Okay, that's okay. He's gonna roost right here. Uh, slack off, I mean. I'm gonna quiver. And if he whirlwinds, then good play on my opponent's part. There's nothing I can do about that. And then we fire blast. Oh, or, or we or just win. Alright, cool. So that's gonna be it for the uh, Battle Factory Live today, guys. I hope you enjoyed. It's kind of uh, just a laid back, relaxed. Uh, live a little bit, but uh, it's nice to have somebody on the channel. It's always nice if anybody uh, wants to join me for any lives Let me know anybody from the NBA the UPA if you're watching this uh, Anybody in general if you're new to the channel be sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already I put out four to five lives a week and um, Also if uh, you want to just like the video check out my uh, my Twitter and my Facebook in the description If you want updates when I put out videos, you can also sub to do that you get them in your sub box So that's pretty much gonna be it guys. Thanks again for watching. I'll catch you guys later. Ciao